Big jump today. Big, jump. big, big jump. <laughs> welcome back. And we'd like to welcome Mark Rogers to the 23 Morning Blend and to Rockford. Good bon morning, John, Mark. Oh, bon bon John, bon John. Bon John, bon John. Absolutely. Mark will be bringing to Rockford next Saturday Da Vinci and Michelangelo, the Titans Experience, a multimedia presentation about those two famed artists from Italy. What inspired you to create this show because you're the guy that uh, put it all together here. Well, absolutely. Thank you. Hey, first of all, thank you so much for being here. I, I invited me to be here this morning. I, I couldn't be any more excited to be here. Um, I'm actually the director of the Da Vinci Machines and Michelangelo exhibitions for North America. And our ex exhibition has been tra traveling the United States for the last five years. And in fact, currently we're at the Water Tower in downtown Chicago uh -huh. on, the, on, the th on the third level. <laughs> and, it, and, it, and, it, and it talks about all Da Vinci's machines and his inventions and so on. But while we were in Denver three years ago, we, we had the exhibition from Florence they sent me the Michelangelo exhibition. And we actually combined both the Da Vinci and Michelangelo, because most people don't know that they were competitors and they, they, really? actually, they actually hated each other. I always say Michelangelo. I guess it's Michelangelo. And you're saying Michelangelo. It actually is Michelangelo. It is, okay. it is Michelangelo, yes. Because actually in, in, um, in Italy, there's two forms of Michael. There's Michael and there's Mikkel, but actually he, it, it is Michelangelo. Okay. Huh. So and they were competitors, even though they kind of worked in different genres, didn't they? Oh, they hated each other. They could really? Da, da Vinci he was tall and handsome, gregarious. Everybody wanted to be associated with Da Vinci, and they actually said he even sang beautifully. Michelangelo was small and diminutive, and he actually said during his life that he hated the way that he looked. And he, and he had this, they had this, this um, what we would call this angry artist syndrome today, hmm. that he had a, this temper that he could unleash at any time, which he did, all the way from servants, all the way up into popes. Wow, okay. And what will people see as you bring this show on the road here? and tour with this year in, in, in Rockford next Saturday. They're going to see movies and animations and they're going to see where about his codices and his um, and we're talking about how they, were, how they were brought up, how they view themselves in life and by the end of the show, you have to come come by this hour and see this, <laughs> by the end of the show we're talking about um, uh, uh, Van Clyburn and Les Paul and Paul McCartney. We're bringing it all in about how these how these men, everything that they said, everything that they did relates to our life today. I mean, they're mm. worth it, how they viewed life, how they viewed the life around them, and everything they said is just very, well, I see we're seeing a little bit of it right here mm -hmm. on the other show. We Looks have these like 3D, well, multimedia. Multimedia, these, we have huge graphics and huge, and these, and these movies, and it is so much fun, and, and we're talking about them, where we interact with the audience, we actually, I actually, <laughs> you can imagine, I actually get a little animated during the show. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we get out there, and it's, it's been, it's, it's been uh, since you've been doing it, the more you find out about these two gentlemen, the more you want to find out about them. And we could not be any more honored, I could not be any more honored to be associated with this project. You mentioned it translates, the, the work that those two men did in Italy centuries ago translates to, you mentioned Les Paul, a guitarist. Oh, absolutely. Paul McCartney, yes. a Beatle. Yeah. Uh, Give us a, a little oh, link sure. here. 2000, listen, because most people know Da Vinci. Let's talk about da Vinci, da Vinci just for a minute. By the Mona Lisa in The Last Supper. But few people knew, well, a lot of people did, a lot of people didn't, that he was one of the most prolific inventors of all time. He had over 44,000 drawings, of which only 14,000 survived. And he, uh, uh, there's over 2,500 of Da Vinci's designs, inventions, and theories that we use every day in our modern day life. He designed the original ball bearing. He mm. designed uh, the parachute. He designed the original helicopter. And we're going to talk about all that if you get through it. And, and, and what the, has Michelangelo got going for him? Oh, man. With his, <laughs> well, the main thing I'll put it is with I want, I want the grand parents. If you're out there, any grandparents out there today, I'm, I want to talk to you directly. Bring your grandchildren to this. Br bring, bring your kids because your you are going, there is no way that you are going to leave this show and not be inspired. Mm -hmm. That you are not way that you're going to say that, hey, listen, I can take what these two gentlemen did and what they saw and what they did in their life and I can transform my life with that. Mm -hmm. And that is the that is the goal of our, uh, of our show. To take these, uh, everything that they said, as I mentioned before, everything that they said, everything that they did 
did applies to our life today. And tickets are available for this experience. It's the Da Vinci and Michelangelo, the Titans experience, coming to the Rockford Theater in downtown Rockford on Park Avenue, 7 o'clock next Saturday night. Tickets range anywhere from $25 to $40. DiscoverDaVinci.com or DiscoverMichelangelo.com, whoever your preference is. Right. is or, a way yeah, to, or Rockford Theater. Dot Rockford Theater. Theater. Dot com is also, get the tickets. There's exactly also a right. way to get the tickets as well, and I believe we got some tickets we'll be able to give away here next week on 23 News this morning. Thank you, Mark. Well, nice to meet you. Well, thank you so much. It's been a I hope you can make it. And we'll try. I hope you we'll can try. make it. Absolutely. Thank you we'll so much. We'll be right back.